Oh hi, this one's for Mike, uh, teaching you how to do pitch bent basses or pitch bent instruments in general, synthesizers in Reaper. So here I have a, an empty project, well not empty, it has uh, an instance of Surge in it with a little bass line I wrote that lends itself well to pitch bends. So bend depth, right here we have two semitones down, two semitones up in Surge, which is my favorite uh, synthesizer of the moment, with a patch that I programmed by hand, oh thank you. I do enjoy programming things, but this is what it sounds like. Okay, that's all fine and good. Pretty, pretty basic. So, what you want to do is go and add a CC lane view thing here, and you want to send it, read it as uh, read it, I don't even know what I'm talking about. You want to set it to be the pitch um, lane here. So now you have both a velocity lane and a pitch lane, which you of course can edit the velocity at any time independent of the pitch. So, uh, to write bends, you can draw them in either by double clicking or um, you can also hit Control and Alt and draw. What is going on? Hold on. Like that. Uh, to rubber band select, you can right click and drag um, and just delete like normal. But the thing is, is that. Uh, shit, noises. Uh, I completely lost my train of thought. It snaps to the grid, the pitch bend amount. So you want to have a pretty small grid so that it's not really obvious, not smooth pitch bends at all. So one thirty second note grid uh, should be good. So let's see what this sounds like. And then of course you have to reset it, as you can see from this block. <laughs> It's still out of tune. Uh, you can also select and hit Control F2 to go and edit. As you can see, this is plus zero, which means that uh, little CC event is at zero, even though the value is 8192. I don't know, whatever. Um, right now, I don't feel like two semitones is enough. So let's go with four. And four. Jesus, so many noises. Sorry, guys. Uh, can I hit zero? Nope. you can go back and change it to be more dynamic by just changing uh, how many semitones. Right now I have six semitones down and six semitones up. And as you can tell, this one, this second bend is a little steep. You can hear it pop right there, so you can just kind of go in and drag each one individually to make shit smoother so it's not a complete hot mess. Uh, you can also, if you right click and drag, oh, it's 
uh, select that one. Right click and drag to rubber band select. If you hit shift, you can also draw in straight lines like that. I kind of like the exponential curve a bit better, like a little parabola sort of thing going on. Uh, it sounds better because it's like, you know, instead of like, it's more fun. So anyway, there you go. That is basic pitch bend stuff. And as you can see uh, here at the bottom of your MIDI item, it actually shows your pitch bends, which is kind of nice. Anyway, there you have it. Cheers. Have fun. Don't kill anyone. See ya.